This is my old Schwinn hardtail that I found in the garbage. And no, I'm not trying to be funny. I actually found this in the trash. It's a pretty decent starter mountain bike. The only problem being that a lot of the components are either really worn out or outdated. One example being the tires, which look more like drag slicks at this point. So for today's build, I'm going to be using this old color shift frame that I painted a few months back and ever since it's just been sitting around and getting scratched. First, I needed to scrap the old mountain bike for parts. I've also had this pretty nice pair of forks just laying around for the past year, so I'm going to try to put these on the build. So with all the components loosely screwed together, it's starting to look like a mountain bike. As you can see, the rims are really dirty and don't really match each other in color, so I'm going to paint them. After letting them dry for a few hours, I put them back on the bike to test fit them. Up close it looks a little tacky, but you know, from 15 feet you can't really tell. After another day of letting them dry, I put the tire back on the rim. So with the fresh wheels set up and put on the bike, it's starting to look pretty good. As you can see, I switched out for blue grips because I thought they looked better with the purple. One of the problems is the chain ring. It doesn't have the right size spacer, so it's really loose. You can also see the headset has that same problem. One of the last things I needed to do was cut the seat post. Surprisingly, it didn't take as long as I thought it would. And there we go, the seat can go down the whole way. So eventually I found out that the forks are actually meant for a tapered headset, which this bike does not have. Luckily I had these old Suntour XTs lying around. So I got the other pair of forks on and the slack problem still wasn't solved. The next day, I took it to the bike shop. I got a new 16 tooth freewheel, a new chain, and some spacers for the headset. And there we go, the build is officially finished. It's a single speed with no brakes at all, just a lever there. I guess that makes it more of a fixy hybrid thing than a mountain bike, but whatever.
Well, if you enjoyed today's video, please consider subscribing to the channel. I'm Kirby Eel, and I'll see you next time.